Tuesday morning here and we've got two pallet jacks ready to go. We got a truckload here. Um, so far, I don't know what to tell you. This is kind of how these come, but um, I can't say what company it is that we uh, we purchased from, but their uh, their tape and their boxes kind of look like that. And we have no idea what's in here. 100% sight unseen. Just uh, guessing. They gave a price. I said okay. That's it. Time to unload it. So far I got about half of it unloaded and it looks like there's a lot of kid stuff in here. I see lots of diapers, boxes of diapers and many of these pallets. There she goes. Truck is out. I guess I should have a light on. But here's what we got. And this is uh, exactly the reason why we want to do this as like event sales. We'd rather have people come in once a month or twice a month at most because we need some time to process. We threw about nine pallets right here and this is right in our vanity section. So if we had, uh, if we had customers coming in today or tomorrow, this would be a problem for us. A lot of this stuff though, it, it comes in boxes like, like this. So this is like a shipping box. This is an undeliverable item. So you open up the shipping box and then that whole box, that's all that's in there. Just a cheapo, cheapo keyboard. Some of them ship in their original box, but a lot of it is just, yeah, like that. And then over here we've got, I think six or seven more pallets. And again, some of these boxes are just gonna have little things in them. We really don't know. This one's all food, so we got a lot of like little bags of chips, kettle, kettle brand potato chips. Uh, my boy likes those, so I'm assuming he's gonna eat those. Those will be like his snack at work, forever. Kettle chips, cases of kettle chips in there. And then the last one. This is the last one we got. Probably the first one we'll tackle. I set it off to the side just so we can. Uh, get around it easier but no idea what's even in here uh, 36 inch tall four panel dog gate an office chair a blender so th this is exciting the first 10 or 20 thousand times that you dig through these boxes but it, it gets actually to be a bit much when you're you're opening these big things you got all this extra packing paper and then you're just taking it and throwing it in the dumpster or storing it for shipping boxes for our eBay stuff. So we'll be tackling this the next couple days. And I'm sure I will be putting a ton of it all over Facebook Marketplace. And also stocking some of our shelves over here. We'll have a lot of this company's stuff on those shelves. Pallet number one. This is a medium bulk load. So everything's at least the size of a shoe box. But realistically it's bigger than that. Almost everything. The items in here are just simply, they're, they're really too big to ship for an eBay seller. So this is pretty much all stuff you have to sell local. This is great for reselling at like a flea market. Unfortunately, there are no flea markets within an hour and a half of where I live. So it doesn't do a lot of good. So Facebook Marketplace is the only recourse. We got a ceiling fan, office chair, a bunch of stuff that we really can't tell. Dish drying rack. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's neat. Some little kid's gonna love that. It's like a hamster house only for kids. I love it. Fan. Uh, five stage reverse osmosis drinking water system. I would imagine that that's worth something. And then I don't really know what any of that stuff is down there. We'll keep digging. Sweet! Look at this! Oh, did you see that? It like did something. Can you see through it? You could kind of see through it, yeah. It's got like a thing. 
I mean, this is the kind of stuff you get off of Amazon truckloads. You never know, but I think some little boy out there would love this for his birthday this summer. So we're going through and uh, we found uh, we found some guitars in here. So we got a quality Taylor guitar with the, with the hard case. And then we got a Chromacast, whatever that is. Let's open this bad boy up. I want to see inside, Nick. We got like an air mattress, a pool skimmer. We got all sorts of cool stuff. Uh, so far, I'm liking this one. It's very random, which I hate. But um, some some definite value. Tons of like Chinese shells. Um, Fufu and Gaga make furniture gain happiness. Um, <laughs> we couldn't find this, so we're gonna build one because we got a bunch. Okay, let me see. So this is the guitar we got. This is one of the guitars we got. We'll open the other one. This is actually a very good looking guitar. It looks it looks cute. I like it. If I knew how to play guitar, I would strum a thing for the video, but I don't, so I'm not going to. My dad could. And then uh, another guitar in a hard case. We're going to open that up in a second here. Oh my goodness, you wrecked the plastic. This is like the official unboxing. Let's see. What came from this uh, online retailer? It's a lot. Come on, pop it open. This video is getting too long. You missed the back one. Right here on the right. There you go. Bam. Nailed it. There's no guitar. We got gypped. Anybody want a guitar case? And I just did it. I literally just said this to Erica. Don't cut the boxes open. Be careful. And I cut it. And I cut it. And yeah, there's fabric. Fabric right there. Ah. Uh, why don't they put that extra piece of cardboard underneath like normal people? They do this all the time. I don't even know what it is. Let's find out. This is the most exciting thing in the whole truck. This plastic roll, this flexible plastic. A lot of our shopping carts we got are damaged like that. Thanks, Gerald. And uh, I was just talking about getting some stuff like this and cutting it to size and then like uh, hole punching it and zip tying it in there to keep stuff from falling out so we can have extra good shopping carts we have like a dozen or 15 shopping carts Ooh, I like that. best item ever now the truck load was worth it We're pretty deep into this amazon load we got some of the area cleared out we got stuff everywhere and i did it again i cut open another bag i cut this open and uh it smells awful i wish it were still smelled still sealed and um i thought it was like chicken feed well that's what it is. Oven dried black soldier fly grubs. That is why it stinks. Note to self. Stop going crazy with the box cutter. My little girl arrived, so it's time for me to go do some uh, babysitting. Babysitting my daughter. That's daddy daughter date is what she calls it. I'm going to go to the park. And we're going to leave this place looking, uh, <sighs> looking like we didn't do anything today. <laughs> 